welcome to another episode of Daddy TV. Today we are making Rainbow, Rainbow Bagels. Bagels. Again, Dolly DTV, I hope you are well. Indeed, we are in our kitchen. Um, this is the first and probably the last time we'll be filming in this kitchen as we are in the process of moving, aren't we? Moving. Moving. Um, why are you voguing? Okay. Are you that excited to make rainbow bagels? Yes, because I love rainbow things and I love bagels. Why not Sorted. put them together with sprinkles that's, that's such good. and so, cream cheese? Without further ado, should we uh, should we start? Yes. Right. Of course. Have you mixed up? I am using a recipe that I'm going to put in the description below. Okay. You need a stand mixer. You don't have to have Sunny. Um, this is sunny. This is sunny. By the yellow. way, um, I'm going to use a recipe uh, that I'm going to put in the description below. 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 Um, and it does require cups. Luckily, I do have these, which are cup measurers, because the Thanks. recipe is an American that use cups. So using cups. So first of all, we need one cup of warm water. Hello. Right, so we've got our warm water in the old mixer room. Okay. We need to have a sachet. This is dried yeast. This is what you use when you make bread. So the warm water helps it activate. So that's why we no. use warm water. Right, so we've got the yeast and the warm water and then I'm gonna add just a, a, a tablespoon of sugar. And we're going to mix it all up so it's all together, nice and gently, until the bubbles start to pop. Yeah, I might go over here so we can sink from. Because it sinks all of our little taste mask. So now we've mixed the yeast with the warm water and the sugar, we're going to leave it now for five minutes, just so it can all go activate and get all bubbly and ready to make the bread. Okay. White flour, because obviously with the different colours of the rainbow, we don't want it to be brown and then colours, do we, Izzy? No, it, it will just end up like poop, and we don't want that, because then, oh. then it won't be called rainbow bagels, it will be called poop bagels. Oh, we don't want that, do we? No. Have you got the colour ready? Wait, yes. Right, so... Lavender. We don't have violet, so we're just using lavender, because that's because we didn't want to go yeah. out and buy the specific colour. And we had some here anyway. Yes. So we've got two two cups of flour going in there, like though. There we go. We're going to start off slow because we don't want to have a shower of flour, do we? No. The colour that we are using is a gel colour. Oh! Right, so now what we have to do if I move Sunny out the way. Oh, we need to get we need to flower the I'll come flower here. the thingy. Yes. What do you call it? Work surface. That's what it's called. The counter. So we're gonna do a bit more kneading just so we can activate <laughs> some of the gluten in it as well. Because that's what makes the bread so light and fluffy. Poke. Uh -huh. Well, it's not bread, it's bagel. Bagel's really made of bread. So, once we've done it and it's all nice and smooth, oh yeah, that's nice and smooth, I think. And then what we need to do now, we're going to put it back in the bowl and leave it for 30 minutes to rise. And I put a little bit of vegetable oil in the, in the bowl. I don't know what it's called then. I let it do its biz. Normally we'd use cling film, but I don't have any cling film at the moment, so we're using foil. So we'll let that raise, right, raise, rise now. Right, so um, our dough's been sitting for 30, 30 seconds, I was gonna say 30 minutes now, but we have made six other colors as well. So what we have to do now is punch down the dough, I, haven't we? I so here we go, are you ready? Let's see how much it's risen. Oh, oh it's the red one, <laughs> not the purple one, it's the red one. Go on then, give it a punch. Ooh, look at that. And then we need to scoop it all out. 
Make sure you flower the uh, table because, or surface, or, or surface. worktop, or counter, whatever you want to call it, because uh -huh. it will stick. So we're going to take the dough out now, we're going to a little bit of a knead, and then we're going to roll it out. You ready to roll it out? Here we go. Here we roll it out. Right, make sure you put some flour on the rolling pin, because otherwise it will stick to the rolling pin. You just need to roll it out to a big blob. A little bit more here. Lovely dough! And then we just need to do that seven, uh, six other times now. Give it a punch! Punch it! Punch it! There you go. Got it? Whack it on the surface. We need to use the palm of your hand here, not the fingertips, the palm. So that's it. That's it. You got it. Try not to rip it though. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try not to. There we go, right, let me have a, a little needy boo. Yeah, there we go, and then we just need to roll this one out now. Ready? Let's put that one on top of there. Oh, it looks amazing. I love rainbow. Yellow. I'm definitely sending a picture of it to Mariah and look at Punch it! Oh, you've got the scooping technique down, girl. Oh, there we go. Thanks. That's it. I think it does help to put a little bit of uh, olive oil in the bowl because look, it doesn't stick. <laughs> so close up my face then. Isn't isn't Izzy doing a good job? Mm -mm, I haven't really done this before, but this is this is this is fun. Yes. Old yellow on top of the orange. Boosh, boosh, boosh. What colour's next? Green. Green? I know my rainbow. Then kind of make it. We want to make I want to make it into like a heart shape. Right, so there goes the green. Blue. Blue next. There goes the blue. Kind of cracked, but. <laughs> Love. This is the purple we just did. Yeah. I don't think it's had that much time to rise. But, but and then the last one on top. I'm just gonna give it a bit of a stretch. Because so it's small. Do you know what we have to do now? Leave it again. Leave it again. After leaving it for half an hour, so all the colours kind of all link together. Look at it, it's huge! It's, it's like a big balloon that's just exploded with colours everywhere. It has indeed. Now we come to the fun bit though. Fun bit? So what we have to do now is we have to cut it down lengthways. Yeah. So all we're going to do, sharp knives, about an inch. That's about an inch. But can I try? Yeah, you can try one in a minute, Spence. But one thing I have to ask Spencer, yeah. are your hands clean? Wait one second. <laughs> I'm going upstairs because I don't want to make the noise. And then stick it together like that. And there is your bagel. Our bagel. Rainbow bagel. Do you want to try? Up there. There's yours, is it? Thank you. And then I'll do this one. So what do I have to do? What do you have to do? So roll it into a Big a tube, gold. a golden tube -y thing, and then we need to twist it, look. Just twist. I'm gonna roll it a bit more. This one's got a lot of purple in it this time. This, this one's got quite a lot of blue in it. And then around we go. There you go, look, you got it. That's a huge bagel. <laughs> we need to chop the ends up a little bit. Spencer's gonna make one as well now. You need to like flatten it down. Choo choo choo! I made mine heart shaped. Well, that's beautiful. There you go. And then if you want to join yours, you need to cut a bit of Spencer's off. Well done, you two. They're really good. I'm gonna put them in the oven now. Um, I can't remember what it said on the recipe. So I will put it in the descriptions below, but I'm putting the oven currently on about 175 centigrade. 
I'm just going to give them a little bit of egg wash on the top to make them go really shiny and crispy on the top. In the oven. Wow. And hope for the best. This is like the fattest kid in the world. Yeah. Have a little look in the oven. How are we going? Wow. Look how big. big they are. Oh my goodness. Look at that one in the middle there. It's huge. I'm kind of worried that they're a bit close to the top of the oven. Here we go. Look at those! They look big and shiny. They look that, that's what I was going to do, yeah. Some of them aren't quite bagel shaped, I must admit. Drying all right. Or cooling that. Look, there's some here. You can see which ones. Look, that one looks a bit more like Pac Man. Look. That's hot! Oh, what happened to my person? person? I don't know, darling. <laughs> look at my person. Yeah. It doesn't look very healthy, does it? So it's the next morning, because um, it was quite late when we uh, finished last night, wasn't it? But we have made them. Here they are. Look at that. We've got our rainbow bagels. They're bagel. so cool when you cut inside of them. You can see all the lovely different colours. But do you know what we need to do now? What? We need to put some... Uh, some fillings in them. Cream cheese. So yep, yeah, cream cheese. Yep. Yeah. So we've got now. So what I've done is I've changed the beater from the dough hook now to the whisk on my uh, stand mixer. And then, <laughs> and then we're going to mix some cream cheese. So yum yum. yum. It is. Uh, I'm just getting a spoon now. Um, cream cheese. It is. We've got 50 less fat. So we've got a cream cheese, cream cheese, couldn't say it then. I'm going to pour that in there. And then, as because rainbow is going to be a, a bit uh, sweeter, shall we say, I've got some icing sugar or powdered sugar. Normally I would sift this in, but as we're not actually icing with it, about that much, I would say. Yeah, about right. Does help if I plug it in. <laughs> We're going to start it really slowly because do you know what will happen otherwise? What do you know what will happen? The icing sugar will go everywhere. It will go everywhere. And my thin one t shirt will get ruined. Oh, we don't want that, do we? Because we can't get another one, can we? Oh, no, because we got that one from Florida, didn't we? Remember that? So we're going to mix it all together. I might add some more sugar in now. It smells funny. There we go. The sugar will make it go a little bit stiffer, you see. And sweeter. And a lot of sweeter or sugar. So we're going to mix that all together. And you know what we're going to add next? Sprinkles! We have got some rainbow confetti. It's not sprinkles, it's rainbow confetti. Yeah. Ooh, I'm going to add these in as well. I want to do it. Let's have a look. Look at that! Thank that looks so good! I think that's done, don't you? Oh! Nearly got ya. Okay. And then what we need to do, oh I think it's a little bit too runny still, so we might need to put a bit more sugar in it to make it a little bit stiffer. That's it. Let Sunny do the work. There you go. Can you see how it looks a bit stiffer now? It looks like dough. It does look a bit like dough. I'm going to do it. There you go. Sprinkle tastic. It is unicorn confetti cream cheese. It is. There we go. See how much thicker it is now? Yeah. Yeah. So, we're going to cut these in half. I've already done the other one, but I'm going to do this one and then we're going to have a look in the middle. So be careful of your fingers with this one. So that's why you put your hand over the top, so it doesn't cut your fingers off. You don't want to spend Sunday afternoon in the uh, old emergency room, do you? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Should we have a look at what it looks like inside? Yeah. Ba bam Wow. Doesn't that look cool? Look at that. Yeah. Should we have a look at the other one I cut open? I haven't looked in the middle of this one. Are you ready? Yeah. Ba bam wow. Oh, that one looks good, doesn't it? Look yeah. at all the green in that one. They look so cool. So I've got my little palette knife. I actually got given this many years ago. 
so I wouldn't know where you would purchase one of these. Probably from a good cake shop. Okay, I'm going to do one, and then Izzy's going to do another one. So here we go. Look at that. You do the one with the hole in. Look at all this. <coughs> yummy, yummy, yummy. Are you ready? I said you did the one with the hole in because the hole. The did I? Without the hole. There's there we go. Look. Mm. Lots of. Look how yummy that looks. Look at all the. Look at all the uh, sprinkles inside. You don't have to put the sprinkles inside if you don't want to, but it's going to be more like a cake. I think, rather than the bagel. A bagel cake. There we go. Which is the top? Is it that one? That's the bottom. Have I just iced the top? Yes. Dolt. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Doesn't that look good? Yeah, did you want the other? Did you want to do the other one? Yeah. Go on then. Just be careful. I don't trust myself. At all. To be honest. This is good. This is bad. This is good. Um. Oh, and then we're going to put the top on. Look at that. Look at our rainbow bagels. Aren't they looking good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to try some of the cream cheese. Okie dokie. So there we are. There's our rainbow bagels all finished. Look at that. So what do you think? Yummy. Yummy. Do they look yummy? Well, you know what we need to do now? Try it. We need to do the taste test, don't we? Yeah. Are you ready for the taste test? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh my goodness. Here we go. We need to go into the one. What are you going to do? Try that one, are you? I'm going to try this one. Are you ready? You go first. I might hold the plate <laughs> underneath you just to be on the safe side. Use those teeth. Go on. Use those teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and my turn. I'm trying to find the narrowest part to bite because. What do you think of that then, Daddy? Uh, looks yummy. I might try some later. Yeah. Well, as I said, the recipe on how to do it is going to be in the description below. But that's our first Dolly D TV baking. Let us know in the comments below if there's any other bacon that you need what need us want us to do. Need. Need need indeed. We did a lot of that with this, didn't we, needing? So if you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Covered in cream cheese. <laughs> do the um, notification bell and subscribe to our channel. It would be greatly appreciated. And until we see you next time, we shall say Bye! Bye-bye. Oh, 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 oh,